Classic elegance, timeless glamour. True compliments for about 50 cars which lined up for the traditional automobile beauty contest, Concorso d'Eleganza Villa d'Este, in the end of May. Among the competing concept cars, one model caught everybody's attraction, the BMW 328 Homage, which pays tribute to a race icon of the 1930s. It's the 75th birthday of the once incredibly successful BMW 328, who won 141 of 172 races between 1936 and 1940. It is a very light car, a very agile car, uh, and that car is so light and agile not because it has a lot of horsepower, but because it's so light. And in the future, of course, saving weight becomes even more important uh, to arrive at, uh, at good performance while using less fuel. And in the future, we're going to do this uh, by using different materials like carbon fiber. And that's why we built this 328 homage car completely in carbon fiber. The 328, I would say, uh, influenced uh, our roads to proportion. So the proportions of our open cars uh, are still like uh, the proportions of the 328 today. Um, driver and passenger sit very far back, almost on the rear axle. And like this, you get a very good uh, sensation of what the car does. Uh, the bonnet, uh, the hood is very, very long. Uh, and um, underneath that bonnet uh, fits the six cylinder in line. And that's still uh, technology that we have today. If you look at the, the modern Z4, uh, we still use those kind of proportions. But how nostalgic can one be? This was discussed by top-class automobile designers on their yearly design talk. To be innovative is only possible if you know your ancestors well. The Concorso d'Eleganza at Villa d'Este is the best event uh, of its kind. Uh, of course, it's in a fantastic uh, setting, but uh, the cars that you see here are uh, extremely beautiful and they are extremely rare. So uh, I always try to bring uh, as many designers out of my team down here as we can, uh, because you see uh, such fantastic shapes, such fantastic attention to detail. Uh, these are things, of course, that we work on every day. Uh, but here, of course, you see how it was done in the past, and uh, it's an incredible source of inspiration. The rendezvous with the past is already over. But in 2012, the Concorso d'Eleganza Villa d'Este will once again showcase the most beautiful automobiles.